today we'll talk about something that is not very clean. We like to talk about poo today. I use the Bristol stool chart to look at uh, to classify poo into different categories. So the Bristol stool chart will identify poo according to the different uh, shapes and form. So starting from pebbles that are really hard to defecate to mushy watery poo. I also look at uh, the amount of mucus, so uh, how much mucus or if it's present or blood in the stool tells you your state of health and also the colour of the poo. If you have got um, poo that actually looks like pebbles, it, you can be constipated which means you don't defecate uh, regularly and you need to investigate whether you've got enough um, hydration, fibre, whether you've got uh, adequate good numbers of uh, good bacteria in the gut and also an investigation that is really important is to see if you have got subclinical hypothyroidism. Hypothyroidism is one of the few um, things that can actually create uh, constipation. If on the other hand you are down the side which is uh, running poos, you will need to look at what actually causes it and it could potentially be food allergies or inflammation that is happening in the gut creating runny poos like ulcerative colitis so it's always well worth uh, investigating what actually goes on and your poo really does tell a lot about your health.